to my channel. If you're new, my name is Carolina. Thank you so much for watching. In today's video, I'm going to be trying out a new Sephora favorite set that just came out on Sephora's website. I just purchased mine and I just got it and I'm so excited to be trying this out for you guys today. I am wearing all the products from the bag, so let me just show you really quick what the bag looks like, which I have right here. So this is the Fresh Face Refresh Sephora Favorites set and this is brand new. It just came out and I saw it and I just had to get it because it includes some of the products that I already really love. You do get nine products including four full size products in this bag for only $45 which is crazy to me. I think this is such a steal. So definitely recommend you guys get your hands on this. It includes some Charlotte Tilbury products, Patrick Ta, Anastasia Beverly Hills, Iconic London Tarte, Rare Beauty, and Ilia. So it's such a great variety of products in here. I will leave a link to where you can purchase this down in the description box below. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys everything that is included in this bag, all the products. And I'm also going to be showing you how I achieved this look. I went ahead and tried out all the products for you guys. So if you guys want to see me trying out the products, just keep watching. Okay, love, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to be trying out the products from the new Sephora's favorite sets that just came out and just launched on Sephora's website. And I love these favorite sets. I picked this up because I actually haven't seen a good one in such a long time, but I saw this one. I was like, I had to have it. And I have everything laid out in front of me, so I'm going to show you guys every item individually and then we're going to be testing them out trying them out on my face there's a few products in here that i have already tried out that i do really like and most of the products that come in this uh kit i have not tried so i'm excited to be trying out product so here it just says it's the sephora favorites fresh face refresh dewy favorites for a full fresh face look and again, it retails for $45, and you do get four full-size products that come in the bag. I don't know about you guys, but I love Sephora Favorites products that they have. They have a variety of kits on their website, and they always come out with different ones every year. The first thing is the Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray by Charlotte Tilbury. And this is actually like their smaller size. This is not the full size, but you still get a good amount in here. So this is just basically just like a setting spray and I have used this in the past and I've used this on clients as well. Um, I have it right here. So this is the one that I've been using and this is like the fresh new one. I'm not going to use this one because I want to save it and finish using this one up. But I do really like it. I like how it keeps my makeup on pretty much all day. I will try to put it on before and after my makeup just to make my makeup last longer. And in my opinion it does. So I do really like it. I mean, the full size is pricey, but if you can get it with this kit, I think it's a steal. So you do get a product by Patrick Ta. This is a shaping wax, and this one's in the shade clear. I have used this product before. I actually did a full video on this, so if you guys are interested, I will leave a link to trying out this product down in the description box below. I tried it out like a while ago. But I did really enjoy it. Next thing is an eyebrow brush by Patrick Ta, which I actually do have. And I cannot find at the moment. So you get the brush there. And then you also get a spoolie on the other side. And I love how like luxurious this looks. I do really like this brush. I like it um, as much as my Anastasia brush. I think it's a great brush. It is pricey, definitely, but again, if you can get your hands on this kit, I think it's a great deal. And then you get a product by Iconic London, the Sheer Bronze in Caramel Glow. I actually have not tried this product, so I'm excited to try it out. This is essentially just like a sheer like bronzer. You get a blush, a cream blush in Peach Sunset. This is by Tarte. This is like my shade. I love a peachy blush. Um, and then you do get some eye products. So you get a mascara by Anastasia. This is the Lash Brag Volumizing Mascara. I actually have not tried this mascara out. I've been wanting to, but I just never got around to purchasing this. So I'm excited to try this out for today's video. Um, you get another full-size uh, 
product by Benefit, the Roller Liner Eyeliner. This was actually in the shade brown. I actually have used this liner in the past, but I actually use the black version, which I have right here. Um, so I actually just have like a travel version. So this is like the full size. This is the one that I've been using, the black one. I actually do really like it. It's waterproof. It stays on my lid. I do really like it. You also get a mini primer by Rare Beauty. This is the Always an Optimist Illuminating Primer Base. So this is what it looks like. The last thing is this product by Ilia. This is the Balmy Gloss Tinted Lip Oil in Tahiti. This looks so pretty. This shade looks so, so pretty to me. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to start by priming out the face using the Rare Beauty Primer. This is the Always an Optimus Illuminating Primer. You do just get a little mini version of this primer. It's not a full size or anything. This is only 0.17 fluid ounces. I have not tried this primer out, but it should be really nice and hydrating, dewy, and illuminating on the skin. Um, I do have some breakouts on my skin, so just ignore them. <laughs> so it does come with a little pump. I'm just going to apply this with my fingers. That's what it looks like. Oh yes, this definitely is a very illuminating, dewy primer. I'm going to let that sink into the skin, and we're going to continue with the brows. I'm going to take the Patrick Ta for Brows Eyebrow Wax in Clear. And I'm going to take that same spray again and just spray it into the pan. So, just like that. I'm going to take the eyebrow brush and I'm going to apply this spoolie right in here. I actually just got my brows laminated. I've been wanting to get them laminated for such a long time but I just never found someone. I just didn't really know who to go to and I just went and I love how they turned out and I also um, got them tinted which is why they look a little bit darker. So I'm going to take the spoolie and just kind of brush my hair up to get that fuller brow effect so this is with the product and this has no product in the brows so I'm going to take this Urban Decay uh, brow pencil and it's the brow blade and I'm just going to add just a little bit of product right here So this set doesn't come with any type of like a foundation product or like a BB cream or skin tint or anything like that. So I'm just going to take my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. This one's in the shade Golden Beige. This is one of my favorite foundations that I have from the drugstore. So affordable. I love how it leaves the skin. You can definitely build it up if you wanted to. You can still see some of the breakouts right here, but I'm not really worried about that. I'm not focusing on that. I do like how the skin looks. So we're going to move on to bronzer we're going to be trying out the iconic london sheer bronzer in caramel glow which i have never tried this product out um so i'm excited to see what it's going to look like i'm just going to shake it up a little bit just in case and this one is a full-size product so that's what the shade looks like that actually is really really pretty that looks like a very natural bronzy look. I feel like that's going to look so pretty on the skin. So I'm actually just going to add a little bit with my finger because I don't want to add too much. And I'm going to take my sponge and kind of just blend this in to the skin. So that's actually really, really pretty. I didn't know if I was going to like this, but I feel like this is perfect for that no makeup makeup look. I'm going to take some on 
this side. I kind of like adding it with my finger first and then blending it out with the sponge. I don't know, I feel like the sponge kind of absorbed a lot of the product. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to just blend it out with my finger first. So now for blush, I'm going to take the Tarte Blush. Again, this one's in Peach Sunset. I am going to take my sponge with this. Kind of just take the product and apply this to my cheeks. Stop. That is a beautiful shade. Oh my god, that is so pretty. I love a peachy blush and this is just me in a color. <laughs> That is so pretty. The only thing I wish I would they would have included is like a little tiny like um, highlighter or like a dew drop or something to kind of highlight the skin. But that's just me. I'm extra and I love a good highlighter. Okay, as far as the eyes, I just added a little bit of this Fenty bronzer just to the crease. Because now I'm going to be taking the eyeliner, the... Uh, roller liner by uh, Benefit. Again, this one's in brown. Oh, it's actually really pigmented. I didn't think it was going to be this pigmented, but I actually like that. That's pretty. And I never do a brown liner on my lid. Now we're going to be trying out the mascara by Anastasia. Again, this is the Lash Brag Volumizing Mascara. I haven't tried to add new mascara, so I'm excited to try this one out. And as you can see, this is what the wand looks like. It has that hourglass shape. Kind of reminds me of the uh, Too Faced Better Than Sex wand, but not as much product is coming off on the actual wand. And that one can get clumpy very quickly. So let's see if this one, this one looks like. Oh, wow. Very black. And it's coating all of my lashes. So like if you have like really long lashes, you just need to add a few coats of this mascara and you would be good to go. Okay, so now for lips, I do have this product by Elia. This is the Balmy Gloss Tinted Lip Oil. And this just looks so pretty. So I'm just going to apply this all over the lips. So, so pretty. I'm going to apply more of the Charlotte Tilbury setting spray just to seal everything. Okay, love, so this is going to be the final look. I went ahead and changed my shirt and I added the setting spray at the end and I think I love how my skin looks. I love how glowy it is. Perfect for the summer. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me trying out all the products from the new Sephora favorite set. I honestly did love all the products that I tried out, even the ones that I had never used. I love this lip oil. It feels so comfortable on the lips. I really hope you guys enjoyed this look. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know any other videos that you guys would like to see here on my channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!